How you feeling about the changes at SLS? What changes? Hey everybody, welcome to the first ever installment of the 2024 YouTuber, should it be YouTuber, YouTuber? Skate Park League. Or should it be Street League or Skate Park League? YouTube? Uh, everybody's warming up right now, and we're gonna do a quick course rundown. Please don't look at me while I record. <laughs> Um, yeah, we're going to do a quick course rundown, um, and hopefully it won't be too long until we kick off the action. All right, so the first obstacle we're going to be looking at today is the seven stair. Um, we've got a hubba on each side. I don't know if, uh, oh, here comes Jeff. Oh, my God. Well, let me tell you what. Jeff is absolutely dominating warm-ups right now. Okay, as you can see, we have a, uh, we have a flat bar which leads into the two block. We have Brian Arnett. We have Jeff DeCesare. You know Jeff's gonna rip this thing a new asshole. Ricky's surprising me. When, when I invited Ricky Glazer to this event, I did not expect him to arrive with the intensity that he's come with. Um, he's been hitting the, the 11 stair hubba. Um, he's been 50-50 he's been grinding massive shit. He's been hitting handrails. He, oh my God, here he is right now. <laughs> Wow, this is exactly what I'm talking about. This is this is a stacked event. Yeah. You you guys missed he he five zero grinded into that manual. That's dude. That's like a best trick. That's a seven point eight at least. Whoa. I'm thinking. What are you thinking, Luke? I'm doing that in the run, bro. No way. Well. If Jeff does inward heel down the thing, which he will, hundred percent. Okay. That's like a nine club right there. Oh, speaking of inward heels, I wanted to bring this up at some point. You remember he uh inward inward healed that uh that set in Arizona for the Thrasher contest. Yeah. Does that look like an inward heel or a pressure to you? I think it's an inward heel. Hey, he won 2,000 bucks. You know what Jeff said about that? He's like, if he didn't land that, the event, like no one would have done a good trick. People would try and like throw an 80 and stuff. I agree, but that was a pressure flip. Oh, we have one of our uh, celebrity judges arriving, what is it, an hour and 30 minutes behind? This course rundown is spiraling out of control quickly. We have a four stair here, and then a four stair there, and then a two stair with a handrail right after it. Can you talk us through kind of like what you're what you're thinking about, how you're strategizing your first run? Well, I mean, if I tell the judges what I'm going to do, am I going to get less points? Or? I'm not a judge, and Luke's not a judge. Oh, okay. So you can tell us whatever you right. want. Well, basically... I'm just trying to be smart about it, doing the stuff I know I can do pretty almost every try. Uh -huh. So I'm gonna start off, do like a, a little line on the four to the four, the Manny, come up here, flat bar. Oh, you're just, gonna, are you gonna walk up the two block? Am I allowed to do that? Oh yeah, you're of course. Wait, why'd, you say, why'd that sound crazy? Yeah, I'm not gonna ollie up it. <laughs> try a trick on the 11. Oh, so you're gonna hit the 11 in the run. I'd like to. All right, Jeff. Thank you for your time. I'll let you get back to practicing. I should probably discuss also the formatting for this event. So I imagine the majority of, majority of you are familiar with Street League, and this is going to be a lot like Street League. Um, even Though Jeff is a beast, he's not quite Gustavo Hibero type level. So I've made a few adjustments. First of all, we're going to have this. Oh my God, is that Donovan? Holy shit. Oh my god. That was so sick. That's our high profile celebrity judge, Donovan Wildfong. Um, you can find him on the Levi's website. What was I saying? Oh yeah, okay. You're probably familiar with the Street League format. And it's gonna be a lot like Street League, but there's some minor adjustments. So we're gonna have two runs, and each run is gonna be one minute long. Only one score from your runs is gonna count, but you gotta keep your run score. And then we're gonna have five scores for best trick but you're gonna get two attempts per score. And we're gonna keep four scores overall. So three scores out of the five for best trick and one score from your line section. <clears throat> from your line section. Anything goes for any part of the contest. The best trick isn't on just one obstacle. It's on whether you wanna skate a flat bar or a box or you wanna hit a two block or you wanna firecracker the fourth stair or do a finger flip down the 11, it does not matter. Those are the rules. Um, and now I think I need to go set up the judging table. You are allowed to be douchey. You can be, you can completely not like somebody for 
no reason or a reason you don't need to explain. Except race and sexual orientation. If, if that's happening in your brain, just don't say it out loud. <laughs>
we have Ricky Glazer, we have Brian Arnett, and we have Jeff DeCesare. You could argue that Jeff DeCesare isn't exactly a YouTube skater. I don't think it matters. He's here. He's ready to throw down. We have our three judges over there. Luke, would you mind zooming in on them? And then there's me, of course, your host. You know who I am. Should I say it again? Our order is Ricky, Brian, and Jeff. Okay. Uh, are you guys okay with that? That's just how I wrote it down. Okay, so... Who, uh, we'll need a timer. Uh, do you have a, can I use your phone? All right. I'm nervous, bro. Ricky, I'm ready when you are. When you pop, it'll be 60 seconds. I'll give you a 30 second warning and then a 10 second warning. Sound good? Yeah. All right. All right, in comes Ricky Glazer with a clean board slide up the rail. Pole jam, okay, good attempt. I see the vision front board on the flat. So that's three grind tricks attempted so far. Um, see how this shapes up. What is he What is he cooking? Ollie up the four. Oh my gosh. Every time he has that back 50 down the hubba, that is not a small hubba, ladies and gentlemen. This is at the 30 second mark now. I told him I'd warn him. Oh my god. Oh, oh, go to oh, manual? Oh, okay, Dad. Kind of tapped. 5-0 into manual. Into, oh, that's incredible. 15. All right, we're gearing up for a trick on the flat. Oh, Trey flip on flat. 10 seconds. It's actually five seconds. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> Fucking first run, his braille skateboard fails him. That is fucked up. What happened, Ricky? I guess I landed too heavy. What do you mean? What? When what you call it's behind you? <laughs> okay, what are we doing? Are we, are we looking at the? Is it my bad? Huh? Okay, we have a 3.3. Where is your dot, Chandler? Bruh. Donovan, 5.3. So you liked what you saw. See, I respected the... The, the pole jam? Yeah. To the recovery. Yeah. And the recovery was humble and positive. I, I like your run too, Ricky. Overall score? 4.2. In the contestants hang out. <laughs> okay, <laughs> we... <did> this, <laughs> don't touch me, because we're trying to talk about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, you guys, you guys like, gotta oh. stand away from the judges' table. <laughs> Are you ready to go? 60 seconds starts when you pop. Ladies and gentlemen, Brian Arnett doing the signature P-Rod prayer. I've done that a couple times myself. I prayed recently when I was trying a crook tray flip. It didn't work. Let's see if it uh, has better effect for Brian. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> he started off with a fakey late body burial. Okay, that was ambitious. Now, with that obstacle, the ledge gets higher and the ground is downhill. So that's, oh my God, what's he doing? Okay, a flat ground heel flip stomped. 20 seconds have gone, Brian. You have 40 to go. All right, he's hitting the hip now. Oh, that was clean, my God. Front big spin. Okay, fakey shove. What do we have next? <laughs> that trick is in, ladies and gentlemen. That is a fakey ollie to fakey pincher grind. This is looking a little better than Ricky's. And we're headed to the 10. Oh. <laughs> okay, that was solid. 10 more seconds, Brian. And we're gonna get to the two here. Fakey board back to fakey. And right on the buzzer. All right, good attempt, Brian, very good. <clears throat> No, 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 take your, take your time, no rush. I want these scores to be accurate. All right, from Neo, we have a 4.3, from Chandler, a 6.1, and from Donovan, a 6.0. I'm telling you guys right now, we we are for sure going a little softer. Everybody's got uh, jelly legs, it's a contest, high stakes, $1,000. <laughs> um, so we're being, we're being modest for everybody's first runs, more counting um, attitude and steez. 
and swag um, yeah, swag points swag are up. Points for days. There's some some little stuff I saw in his run that made, bumped him up a little bit. He pee rod it in. just by a point. Maybe it was point two, but still, still there. Good attitude. Yeah. Score, buddy. Oh yeah, yeah. Five point four. Five point four, Brian. So, I got a five point four. Yeah, yeah. not bad. <laughs> I did like two tricks. <clears throat> See, I've been noticing Jeff, even after he's been told to leave the vicinity of the judges' table, he's hanging behind there. I think that he's looking to collect all of the information that he possibly can about just what the judges are thinking today. Sounds good. Yep, whenever you're ready. All right, here comes Jeff DeCesare. All right, hitting the four. Front pop down the four, first four, no push. Oh my God. Double flip. Oh, into manual. Wow, that was an impressive sequence. Immediately off the board, it's only been 10 seconds. Back feeble. My God, that was less than 20 seconds. Absolutely stomped. Sent a sonic boom through the skate park when he landed that. Nolly back lip. No push. What's he setting up for? Laser. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking flip. That's been 30 seconds. Listen, you might think that it's only on the gram. This shit is no joke. This is real life right now. Okay. 40 seconds. He's got plenty of time. I haven't told him how long he has. Shit. Um. <laughs> oh. oh. My. You still have 10 seconds, Jeff. You, you can keep going. I think anything outside of the nine club is a fucking travesty here. And right on the buzzer. Okay, that's time. Thank you, Jeff. I'd be curious to see what the judges make of that. From my perspective, a line like that is undeniable. Um, and Jeff was actually worried about the line section, but it seems like everything went according to plan. Yeah, seven, nine because I want to see more less TikTok looking like a fucking goddamn baby giraffe. I just think I would like it to be a little bit more cleaned up on the roll-up. Okay, so we have a 7.8, a 7.9, and another 7.9. And tell me, why are we not in the 9 Club right now? He missed the last trick. There was a little bit of sketchiness on the roll-ups, not necessarily like the roll-aways. Okay. Anybody else want to explain they're not a nine? Okay, uh, I it was insanely good, and um, I I kind of am like rethinking some stuff. If he lands the line, points. he well, we he's gonna get a nine. Failed, right? yeah, but <laughs> it wasn't a clean run. There's room for improvement. So wow. I'm trying harsh. to laugh, bitch. Harsh from the judges. Harsh from the judges. I don't like them looking at me when I'm talking yeah, about the run. It's awkward. That's the goal. I'm like, I could be a total cut and be like, girl, I wasn't a sled. 7.8. 7.8. Oh. Ooh, it's going to be hot in that comment section. I want to hear your take. My take? What do you think of the judging right there? If I were to give you an analysis on that run, I'd say that was awesome. All right, here comes Ricky Glazer on the brand new board. All right, beautiful backboard, up and down. Little pole jam, into the flat bar, lip. Ooh, save that one, that almost got ugly. I forgot to start the timer. Let's say that's been eight <laughs> seconds. <laughs> okay, ollie up the four, nice. Okay, into the hubba, what do we have? Another back 50, perhaps? Yes, indeed. Excellent, okay, it's been 25 seconds. Oh, okay, touched on the manual. 30 seconds, Ricky. Oh! Oh my, oh my god! Back three lip. Turning right around. I heard Donovan say, what the fuck? Ooh, stomped it. And tail the fakie on the board breaker. 10 seconds! I really need to do my job better. Here he comes. Front blunt, that's gonna be time. <sighs> Is it gonna get even more controversial over here? <laughs> oh, 
Oh no! We got some drama! Oh my god, we have a, a 9.0, an 8.7, and an 8.9. You were smiling, you were you were creative, you were smiling. Thinking, you were thinking on and your toes. You, you did you were like, oh my god, I hear I fucked up this, you didn't make a face about it, you did a 270 lip that was Sick, and then you did a cool turnaround, and the landed what broke your board last. It was time. also it was a, a triumph. Story. Yeah, was you guys really interpreted luck. the five zero grind to not to scrape manual as a make. It was no, lit. it was not. I, I think was, I think that the recovery the was recovery what was, out okay. of it was, was a right, cherry on the top. It was okay. like all right, that well, was cool. I've heard enough. <laughs> Neo, do we have our overall? Eight point six. Eight point six overall. Eight point six. Okie dokie. Let's see if I remember to start the timer this time. Hey, what's that laughing over there? Y'all ready? <laughs> <laughs> All right, it appears as though Brian is going to be starting at the 10. Bang, yeah. back 180. Very nice. So this is a different strategy. Typically, skaters will save their best trick for last. But Brian, maybe he doesn't trust his legs. Okay, back to fakey. So he starts off with the back 180. Oh, good try. That's uh, 20, that's been 20 seconds. God, that was a dumb time to tell him that. <laughs> okay, what do we have here? Front <laughs> okay, front Willie. Now he's testing the judges with that selection. Um, he wants to see what they're willing to tolerate, and that's a high risk strategy, but high reward. Another clean front big. 15 seconds left. <clears throat> oh, a little hiccup. Okay, faking nose slide back to regs. Five seconds! All right, headed for the seven. Oh! Oh, hot damn, and that is time. 8.1, 9.0. Is that an 8.9 from you, Donovan? Look at all this fucking product placement on here. <laughs> God. I couldn't even get a sponsor for this, by the way. I sent Raid Shadow Legends an email, and I asked them. I was like, all I want is like $2,500 and a big Raid Shadow Legends check, and I'll make it worth your while. They never even fucking responded to me. 8.6 overall. Okay, Jeff's body language, I'll tell you. He's looking a, a little defensive right now, and I gotta say, I don't know if I can blame him. Um, so, there's two ways you can handle a situation like this. Front pop, you can fold, or you can get revenge. Perfect, three-piece sequence. Okay, we have a civilian with the AirPods in. See how Jeff handles this. Headed to the seven. Oh, Nolly this time. Oh, Nolly flip stomped. It looks like Jeff is taking his rage and he is channeling it into some perfect skateboarding right now. And he has taken the judge's advice so far. Oh, almost. And uh, n much less tic tacs this run, much less tic tacs. 20 seconds, Jeff! 20 seconds. All right, that 20 is about to be 10. Okay, so he's trying to time it up to hit the 11 here. What is it gonna be? Ooh, almost. All right. And that is gonna be time for you, Jeff. <laughs> there seems to be a lot of uh, concern with how much fun the skaters appear to be having from the judges, which is, uh, I guess I never gave any scoring criteria, but if I did, that would not be in it. Yours is backwards, Neo. Come on, dude. Okay, we have an 8.2, a 7.9, and a 7.7. .7. Okay, so is that an improve? That is that an improvement on the initial run? Yes, I. It is supposed to be sick. <laughs> And the nollie flip. I'm not gonna argue, I'm just confused. <laughs>、okay. A 7.9 overall. 7.9. Okay, alright, and what was the first score? 7.8. I 
am not gonna say anything about that. All right, so what are the standings right now? Who's got the top run score? It's tied. It's tied. Oh, it's tied between Brian and Ricky? Brian, yeah, Brian and Ricky, Ricky had an 8.6. Okay, all right, so they're gonna rock, paper, scissors. Um, for, for winner? No, 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 no. For, <laughs> not for winner. They're gonna rock, paper, scissors for uh, who goes last. So Jeff's last place goes first, Jeff goes first, then second, then you, know, you get And what deal. is it on? Anything. Which I did explain. Oh, best trick. Yes, right. best trick. Not biggest trick. It's usually biggest trick. Like it usually ends up being the biggest trick. Sure. Yeah. Uh, let's. Uh, where's Brian? Brian, you and Ricky got to play rock Joe's paper scissors. Right I'm not being anything. I'm just keeping my opinion to myself. He's seeing it. Tough being Andrew Cannon. No, it's way, dude. Being Andrew Cannon is way easier than being me. Oh, okay, to go last uh, for best trick. For best trick, yeah. Oh my god. Wait, 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 once or two out of three or one, two, just two. Once, just on, once, man. once. Behind the back. One, two, oh, three. Oh my god. Oh, okay. All right. So Brian's last. You're second. Jeff, you're first in best trick. <laughs> Jeff De Cesare in last place. <laughs> Believe it or not. Um, whenever you're ready, Jeff, we're good to go. Looks like he's going to be gearing up to hit the seven here. Ooh, double tray. All right. So you got another try, Jeff. Okay. Now, fun fact, a little bit of skateboarding contest lore. Shane O'Neill did this trick switch a long time ago. And I think it maybe got like a 9.9. .9. Uh, good try from Jeff. For now, that will be a zero. Ricky, what are you hitting? All right, the 11 rail. Nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Here comes Ricky. Wow, all right, a backboard. Ricky playing it on the safer side today. We'll see how impressed the judges are with that. I could see us dipping into the high threes. Yeah. What'd you do? Wow. Okay, so we have a 7.5 for a board slide. So you guys are kind of a bunch of more street skating minded. Would you say that you're kind of a simple tricks done well kind of crowd? No, I, don't know. I think so. Because yeah. yeah. that is the only thing I can think of to explain that. All right. <laughs> Thank you, judges. <laughs> All right, back down we go. Okay, Brian Arnett. First single trick attempt on the 11. <laughs> <laughs> My God. <laughs> The judges are jumping out of their seats right now, and I have one thing to say, Luke. That was awesome. Oh my God. Let's see what the other judges are feeling. Nine with, and a 9.8, a near perfect score that from Chandler. Fun. That was fun. Nine club. Yeah. Yeah. YSL official nine club replay. On the 11. <laughs> we make it look easy. The two block? All right, let's go the two block. Um, Jeff, whenever you're ready. Now, if I were to expect, I would think we're gonna see something a little more simple here after a board slide got a seven and a half. Oh, and I'm wrong. Oh, celeb shot. Jeff really needs a make here. So that would be two zeros, which would not be good. Oh, to Primo, triple flip. All right, good attempt, Jeff. Pickle Ricky. Oh my god, we are getting tech kickflip 50 into the hubba. Let's see if he's got it. Pretty technical, that's a steep hubba. Okay, all right. Good try from Ricky. Now it's Brian's turn. Two block? All right. All right, he is smiling, looking at the two block. I think he's cooking up something devious right now. Um, and he's coming off, don't forget, he's coming off a new. All right. Rolling up regular. Is he trying? Okay, he is. 
Oh, forward flip. Now, there's a possibility, a slim possibility, that Brian has done his research here, and he knows one of the judges is somewhat of a dolphin flip master. Oh, shit. That had some movement to it. As predicted, Chandler Likey. It's starting to look like Brian is running away with this thing. Okay, oh, we're back in the nine club, ladies and gentlemen. We have a 9.3 and two 9.1. YSL official nine club replays. Oh, 9.2. shit. Luke, how do you think I would fare in this kind of contest? I don't know if you can go big. Mm, yeah, I can't. Attempt number three. Really need to make here. Ball. Holy shit. The reverse Shane O'Neill. 9.8. Really need to make here. Ball. 9.8. Love to see that. Well, the thing is, look, I'm in an interesting position. Brian got two high scores. Yeah. I got a mid score. Now I need to get higher scores to win, but I don't think I can do that. So I, what do I do? I mean, all you can do, Ricky, is your best and hope that everyone else falls. Oh, okay. So this is an interesting scenario now. Well, if you fall on the second one, you get a zero. Yeah, yeah, I'll do that. You want to redo? Yeah. All right. Wow. Wow. All right. What do we got? What do we got? Eight two, eight three, eight five. The judges liked it. You guys do acknowledge that it was an accident? Yes. yes. Okay. There's one thing we know about you guys. It's all about recovery, right? Yes. <laughs> It's, okay. It's over to every other underdog redemption story, honestly. Mm. Okay. All right. Well, thank, thank you, judges. judges. Brian, where are we going? Give me a sec. Okay. <laughs> Brian does not know <laughs> what Tricky's doing. All right. We're going to the 11. The sun's coming out. The temperature is rising. Things are heating up in the physical and metaphorical sense here. Brian Arnett taken out the chain he knows the judges like swag <clears throat> what could he possibly have up his sleeve now wow going for a hard flip now that's a uh, a little bit more of a traditional maneuver than i think we're used to seeing brian uh attempt on a skateboard but i do think that with kind of a core panel that we have over there i think that's really going to resonate assuming he lands it of course let's go brian hard flip <laughs> yeah so there's been a lot of talk of p-rod today fun fact if you didn't already know somehow brian managed to finagle p-rod to come to his house and do a drunk live stream where he actually talked a bunch of shit about contest skating, ironically. The stomp factor is out of bounds. I don't even want it. I don't even know if I can look at the judging table right now. <laughs> 9.7 from Neo, a nine and a half from Donovan. 9.6, 9.7, and a 9.4. Fucking insane. It was, that was bold. It was. And, it was beautiful. And he, That's the thing, he, he went, went shit fucking crazy. Yeah, he went, I'm gonna do that real quick. That's funny. <laughs> Kicked the rock out of the way. Tugged on See, the branch. That shit matters. Threw, threw it down. <laughs> YSL official nine club replay. Got you. 9.5. Oh 
Jeff, the judges are ready, so whenever you're good. Now, I do believe Jeff cannot afford to bail another trick to be in the running. Oh, all right, triple flip. Looks like he landed in sort of the course area of the rollaway, as you can see. I mean, this is the most popular obstacle at this skate park. There are many kids that come here for the express purpose of hurling themselves down this tube block, and there is decades of wear. Oh, triple flip. Hold it out. Good shit, Jeff. Good shit. All right. Now we got to make the long walk back to the judging table. Are we going to be in the nine club with the triple flip down the two? I'd imagine that we are. Ooh, a 9.7 from Donovan. A 9.5 from Chandler, whatever your fucking name is. And a 9.3 from Neo. Triple kill! 9.5. All right, hitting the hubba. Okay, we have the dark slide. We saw him practicing. Gentlemen, you know. Oh no, you go. What are you, you guys are not supposed to be talking right now. You got this, Ricky. Ricky is probably solely responsible for ruining this trick. Oh. Hey, where are you going, Ryan? Um, I think two block. Hey, two block. Two block. My you bad. turn. Sorry. <laughs> Brian. Thank you. Okay, Brian's letting us know fakey, so maybe we should go on the other side. Luke. Hey, fake. You know, you gotta get the Brian. No, no, you you right as fuck. <laughs> Damn, Luke getting shaded right now. Wait, no, we did film the hard flip from the right side. Nah, we didn't. It was ass side, but it was like it was still looks sick. It's still fire. He's tripping. All right, fakey. There's just a certain energy in the air. When he's rolling up, he's just emanating confidence right now. Let's see what the judges have to say. 8.9, 8 8.9, 8.7. 8.8. 8. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take right, it. We need stock footage of Jeff. Jeff, I'll take it. pretend to react to a score. Jeff to Cesare, 7.6. Uh, Ricky Glazer, uh, 4.8. <laughs> Dude, he's so good at it. Neo's got all of the information that we need, so we are now on the fifth and final score. So you've got our rankings here. So we have the three scores from the best trick, if they've landed three tricks, and one score from the lines, right? So walk us through what's happening here. Okay, so in third place, we have Ricky with 24.3 points. In second, we have Jeff with 27.2 points. And in first place, we got Brian with 36.8 points. Ricky can't, Ricky can't win. Ricky is out of the race. Sorry about that. Is there a prize for second? Yeah, well, there will be, there will be prizes. Let's just say... If you're a big Jimmy Neutron fan, <laughs> I would try pretty hard. <laughs> Can you do the math so we know how much Jeff needs to, I don't know, tie or win? What do you mean? Okay. Sir? Jeff gets 9.5. He doesn't win? He, or he does? That's a seven, by the I don't think... See, I did not want wait. footage of all of us not getting basic math. You see that clip of me and my friend? So, at Buffalo Wild Wings, and we're trying to do the math. Or you didn't see no, that? No, I didn't see no, that one. Brian's the only one with three best trick scores, right? Yeah, yeah. Everyone else has two. Okay, Jeff needs a 9.6 to tie Brian's score. So Brian already I has. We're supposed to calculate it before the. Okay, back to me. Brian's the only one with three landed tricks in the best trick section. So Jeff needs a 9.6 to tie where Brian is right now. Wait, if it's last, should we do a re rack or no re rack? I think we should re-rack. What do you think? So Ricky goes first because he's in last for the mm. final attempt. I think that would be maximum stakes. Yeah. And that's what we want, really. We're in the business of creating drama here. Rule announcement! Rule announcement!
Ricky's gonna go first. We're gonna Wait, we're, because I gave away my. No, study. because we're gonna re, with the, in street league they re rack okay. on the last attempts they re rack. Right. Yeah, so well, we're I'll gonna re rack. Trick in the name of sportsmanship. Ricky first, okay. then Jeff, yeah. then Brian. Can you I don't know that? what's gonna happen. Yo, I'm gonna need that uh that the footage. Angle? Yeah, if you wouldn't mind airdropping yeah, to me that so later. Ricky's, okay, I'll you talk gotta, to him. You gotta sign the contract. I'm not signing any fucking Ricky Braille. Anyway, Ricky! We already know what's gonna happen. He's going for the dark slide. <clears throat> oh my god! Let's go! That was epic! Ricky, 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 Ricky. We have, okay, so we have a 9.4, a 9.5. And a, was that a 9.3 Neo? Face the other way, bro. <laughs> other way. YSL official 9 club replay. <laughs> I gotta say, in the moment, I was in my head that was a 10. The, you thought it was a 10? It was the spot? Yeah. <laughs> it was... The it spot? Was, the spot. <laughs> <laughs> it was sketchy. Bizarre. Okay. I think if it was on a rail, it would have gotten a 10. I think if that was on a ledge, it gets the 9.5. But I really liked it. If it was on like okay. a little, something a little bit better, but I liked it. It was fucked. Everything could change right here. Jeff needs a pretty absurd score to make this happen. But if anybody can pull a 9.6 out of their ass, Jeff's the man. He's got a lot of nines in his ass. Where are we going? The 11. The 11. All right. That's what I like to hear. I feel like I need a 9.6 right now, Luke. I'm ready. Judges, are we ready? We are ready. Everybody is locked in. Laser focus. The margins for this are razor thin. He's waiting for the wind. He's a smart guy. This is not Jeff's first rodeo. The suspense is killing me. Okay, all right, it had to be this way. If he landed the first attempt, not that dramatic, but if it comes down to the very last opportunity that he has, and I gave him a tip earlier. I said, Jeff, you wanna save your best for last. You wanna milk the moment for everything that it's worth. And I would say he might've intentionally bailed that, Luke. Here he comes. Second attempt. Oh my god! And he pulls it! Unbelievable! Good shit, Jeff. Good shit. I broke my nose. Damn, well that was worth it. Well now it. I have a cracked tail and nose. Obviously strong, guys. Check it out. <laughs> Cracks everywhere. Jeff is not happy with his pro model. Let's go to the judges. They're whispering. What you guys uh, talking about over there? We're, we're judging. Show me the money. Okay. All right. YSL official nine club replay. Oh my God. 9.8. And he pulls it. Unbelievable. That means Jeff is your new leader. Thanks. Right. Uh, so he, he needs higher than a 9.4. Brian needs a 9.4 to take the dub. Yeah. All right. I think I could, I think I could do that. Where are we going? I don't know. Okay, all right. Let's give Brian a second to figure this shit out. What do you think, Brian? Walk me through your options right now. What are you thinking? I think Jeff got like a like a nine eight for double tray on this. So I think if I do some double shit, yeah, I'm thinking backside double. That would be hot. All right. Judges, are we locked in? We're hitting the seven. All right, guys. A 9-4? That's what he needs. <laughs> Dude, just think about how lit the stream is gonna be tonight if you land this, bro. Right here, Brian. Okay, Brian Arnett. Rumored double backside flip down the seven. Ooh, all right. Try. 
<laughs> that did not look too promising, but people are saying that Jeff might have intentionally bunted his first attempt. Could Brian be utilizing a similar strategy? Oh, he's walking up the stairs <laughs> very slowly. With the heartbeat sound effect. Right here. It's a, this is the entire event on the line right now. Let's go, Brian. He's hitting the big side of it. The right hand side is a little shorter. Victory from the jaws of defeat. Can you believe it? I completely wrote him off in my head. What do you got? Anything can happen at the YouTuber Skate Park League. First of all, <laughs> oh, I'm victory not, speech. I'm not even sure why I'm here. I'm not a YouTuber. But... You know why you're here? Why? Because we can rely on you to pull an inward heel down a 10 Bro. stair at any time. Brian, Brian got two like tricks on that and the best trick. He's the one killing it. I think. Okay, okay. Give, give me first. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Hey, I'm not a judge. Okay. <laughs> In third place, Ricky, you do like Jimmy Neutron, right? Sure. Cool. Thank you. Jimmy Neutron, Boy Genius, Jet Fusion. Fine tingling secret mission. Plus six daring bonus episodes. Very nice. All right. Now, we got, and then in second place, Brian? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten thousand to one thousand yeah. dollars. Yeah. All right, and then Ricky, I was, I was just kidding. There's a oh, hundred for you. Thank you. And then... 200 oh, for you, Brian. And uh, thank you guys for thank participating. You, thank you for having It would be nothing without you okay, guys. Okay, wait, wait. We gotta see you all at the 11 now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, come they on, see it. They yes. see it. Yes. 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 it. Fucking last time Brian gets invited to one of these. I'm gonna react to this on my stream and make, you know, get a little kickback from that. Smart man. <laughs> okay, alright, alright, alright. Do you want to say something? Shout out to Sweden. Oh! Oh! Oh, oh my god. Oh. Oh. oh, Jeff! Oh! Yeah, Jeff! So, we had a suggestion from the audience right there. He suggested we have the judges skate and the skaters judge. So we'll just do a, a blitz, no runs, all best trick. Let's rip it right now. Let's make this shit happen. We'll do three double tries, yeah? Yeah. I'll, I can go in. Who's going to host, though? Um, there, is no, there is no reverse to the host unless I film and you host. I can Let me FaceTime Dan Corrigan. All the tape and skate. <laughs> all right. Um, I, I don't think I should even be on the mic. I think I should just fuck off and skate. Yeah. Are you guys ready? Scoot over a little for me, Luke. <laughs> wow! What's up, dude? Wow! What? What? Woo! First tee? That was solid. It was on the hip. Um, it was uh, pretty perfect. Holy shit! 
I want to see. Right. I want to see a bigger obstacle. Oh, okay. Less pivot, buddy. I kind of. <laughs> <I> listen, <laughs> you guys, you give me your opinions with the scores, please. Go, Chandler. Donovan. <laughs> you know, you're supposed to be thinking about that kind of. Oh! Hey, that's already a 2.4. Back through kick is kind of risky too. But yeah, it's a bit more knowledge. Yeah, I don't I think it's still in the seven realm. Yeah. 7.2. Oh, it's the same as, as yeah. Joe's. Whoa, yeah, that's but that's good though, I think. I, I feel like that was a similar skill. You gotta put it down though. I know. You gotta put it down. I actually don't care if I put it down. Okay, well you... all that matters is I'm having fun. <laughs> what the fuck ever? What the fuck, Jeff? That's what skating is hey, about, I, looking cool, right? Yes, I felt good about that, actually. Okay, 3.6 average. Eliminated. Yeah, what happened back there? Uh, probably nine times out of ten I do it, but this was the ten percent of the time that I don't do it. And unfortunately, that's just how it goes in a contest scenario, but you know, next time I'm gonna bring my A game, I'm gonna work twice as hard, and I'm gonna come back stronger. Chandler Burton, 10 flat. Eliminated. Oh! 
eliminated. Taylor's our winner! I got a 3 6. So, you, well, we counted 0.3 from the first one, so those two counts, you got 3 9. <laughs> I'm down $1,400, $1,500. I haven't even paid Luke yet. Leave a like. Whatever you want. Wow. Hell yeah. <laughs> Thanks.